Okay. Part two of uh, the Deville this it the Deville was auto adjust. Yeah, the Intellipath. Intellipath. Okay. All right. Continue. You were talking about uh, the ramp settings. Yeah. So uh, so you have your ramp settings. Um, you can do your delay time uh, and pre and set all that. So right there's your delay button. Uh, that you can hit so if you you know got up in the middle of the night use the restroom and come back and you just tap the delay button to start your ramp again you know that's nice i, I don't know if i don't know if uh, the i don't think the respironics has that feature i guess you just got to take off your mask yeah, i think that their ramp button is right there oh so you hit that yeah that's okay the ramp. all right and then of course something else with our unit that's nice and i'm pretty sure the restaurant has, has it as well is we have a pressure transducer so there's automatic altitude adjustment Oh, that's nice. Because so a lot of people goes, travel with these. Yeah, they try, yeah, exactly. So this goes up to 9,000 feet, and it'll automatically adjust to your altitude. Now, one of the questions that I get a lot um, is that a lot of these people uh, that travel, they, um, they forget it or they lose it or whatever. Um, do you recommend they take it on the plane with them? Yeah. Or, or checking it in a bag, uh, in their bag. Or... Well, something else that's nice about our new design of our bag is this little side part. So if you can see this right here, so this is actually able to go over the luggage extender. Oh, I see, right there. So you can see how that is. Yeah, so yeah. whenever you have your right CPAP there. in the bag, good you idea. pull your luggage extender out, you can slide C5. this over your... I don't think they got that on there, no? Oh, so that's that certainly yeah. makes it easier. It's something new that we just added. So, you know, it makes it easier for traveling. So We get so many calls, people forgetting their CPAP, and they desperately need to. Um, and, you know, until I, we get A-flexes in our rental fleet, we can't do anything about it because they got to have a prescription. Mm -hmm. They have to have their ramp because we can't set it without a respiratory therapist. Yeah. And, uh, and I, I won't take the liability risk. That's what we have to explain to people that we can't – we can't rent these within 24 hours. Mm -hmm. So if we start doing the A-Flex, though, then we just send it to them. But see, one of the things that a lot of people don't understand, too, is we do we have sold these to people that don't know that they need a BiPAP. Yeah. Yeah. And what happens is these things, they're auto-titrate. They, mm -hmm. they can't read them. Mm -hmm. And it'll just, it'll, just, it'll just randomly run really loud. Mm -hmm. They need to be on a BiPAP. And then they all, you also have an auto bypass for this. Yes, exactly. So, which the auto bypass is the same size. It's okay. just going to be able to do higher pressures up to twenty five. Well, that's nice. Yeah. Yeah. Another big distinction between you know probably between these two is the fact uh, the warranty. Okay. So the warranty is five years on this unit, and I believe that the warranty for the restaurant is th two years. Is it? A th I think it is. Years. You're right. Yeah. I'm pretty sure. I'm not, yeah. Well, that's a big yeah. difference because if these things go down, a lot of people are just buying them outright because they don't want to do the sleep study anymore. Yeah. And they just buy them because they're going to have them for the, you know, five years if it has a five-year warranty. Yeah. And it'll set itself so they never have to. Um, what they do is they take their smart card out, mm -hmm. take it to their doctor once every six months, mm -hmm. and the doctor can look at, see how he's doing on the smart card. Um, yeah, now we also have the smart code available. Okay. Something else we have is what's called uh, smart code. Oh, okay. Now, what that is is a 12 digit code that you can read that off the unit. All you, when the unit's in the off position, you can press this left arrow. It'll give you that 12 digit code and it'll actually let you know how you're doing. So, you wow. can type that code to our, into the website or software, uh -huh. and that code will let you know how you're doing on that. So, it'll tell you your AHI, your leak. Uh, all of the information. Can you email that to your physician? Sure. You could download it. Sure. You, well, you could. What you can do is write that down and call okay. your physician, give them that code, and your physician can actually go. Oh, and he that. can go on it. Oh, that's he can great. Go on and look at it exactly. So you don't have to keep track of the of the card. Okay. I'm going to tell you this has been extremely informative. So if you're looking for a CPAP, and I, re I highly recommend uh, the the a, a uh, the auto titrate. Um, I've done a pretty good comparison of the two, um, the two out there that I recommend, um, the two that I think uh, you should certainly look at. The price is good. Uh, this one is actually uh, less than this one here. So um, this is the one that we can get out quickly. Uh, we usually have them in stock. And, um, made in America. Made in America. So you got to love that. So we appreciate your time. Uh, my website, once again, is GoSouthernMD.com. And you can call and ask for me. My name is Robert. My number is 
2539 and all the information is on my website under CPAP. Click on CPAP and then you can take a look at the, the, the Vilvus. It'll give you additional specs and, and other information. We're always available for y'all. If you got any questions, you can call us anytime. We appreciate your time. Thanks for watching the video.